his son, 15 years old, is an amateur. He, he has no obligation to talk to anybody. But if I was a parent with a 15-year-old, and, and, and I know my own notoriety, I would protect my, my, my child to the fullest extent. And uh, so, in my opinion, Carlos Menares, uh write about something else, right? Why don't you write about the leader instead of Tiger's son? Do you don't and, well, uh, well, hang on a second, Ron. Do you think that nobody has interest in Tiger's son? Nobody cares what Charlie Woods is doing? No, I don't. Oh, Wait. come on, Ron. Ron, the entire gallery at, at Oakland Hills is, is following Charlie Woods. Yeah. There's interest there. Well, you can't you can't skirt that. Not me, okay? I tell you what, I'm a Tiger fan, all right? And he's had a tough life. Some of it was self uh, self induced, some of it yeah, yeah, I'm a ti- I'm a Tiger Woods fan too. I'm a huge Tiger Woods fan. Are you are you going out there to Oakland Hills to watch the event? No. Okay. Yes. Then th- <laughs> those that are are going to watch Charlie Woods. That's why they're there. Those that continue the rest of the week are going to go there to watch the rest of the golfers. But right now, everyone's concentrated watching Charlie, and you'll have a couple pockets there watching some of the other golfers, but. 90% of that crowd is going to be following Charlie Woods come 148, I think is when he tees off on a south course. And, you know, is is it wrong to put a 15-year-old in this position? You can argue that. And I'm not saying he has to be the most articulate, most well-polished person in front of the cameras and microphones. But I'm also saying, that look at it in a, in a positive light and say, look, this is, this is something you're going to have to deal with if you make it to the level that you want to make it to. If you want to be a professional golfer, a professional athlete of any kind, you're going to have to speak in front of cameras and microphones. If you end up going to going to college and playing golf, guess what's going to happen after one of your, your tournaments? You're going to have to speak. This gets you a head start. You already know what it's like. You don't have to say the most fascinating things in the world everybody hanging on your every word you're a kid i think people are going to cut you slack but to run away from it it's not a good look and i give him a pass for yesterday but what happens today if they run off the course again today it's not a good look to do it two days in a row i guess that's what i'm saying and i, I didn't have a problem with yesterday